What's up YouTube? I'm Vern. I'm Hunter. Welcome to another edition of Pokeboy Productions channel. So we're going to do another um, out of uh, house unboxing. Someone else is doing unboxing my brother again. So, <laughs> so keep watching. Alright Hunter, you know what we're unboxing? Uh, or Evans unboxing. Yeah, it's another game. When it comes to Evans, it's always a video game or some sort. <laughs> yeah, he loves his games and he gets the collector's edition. So this is Ghost of Tsushima. It's the collector's edition. Uh, a lot of goodies inside, so we're going to check it out. And uh, we're going to start it right now. Let's go watch. Hey everyone, welcome to another remote unboxing for PvP. This time is for the Ghost of Tsushima. Collector's edition box here. Uh, box is small. Yeah, it's I'll not as big the, as uh, opening Last of Us. Again. Last of Us. Uh, I'll probably be playing this game, and I'll have some gameplay of it on my usual Twitch channel at twitchtv slash inc seventy seven i n c seventy seven. All right, let's get on with it. Go follow him. <laughs> All right. So this yeah, goes his gloves again. Smaller. I think we should upgrade to gloves too, right, Hunter? <laughs> Back in the box. Side. A lot smaller box than the Last of Us, so. Definitely. Looks nice. Here we go. Still big, though. I mean, smaller box, but it's still big. It's a decent size for, yeah. for collector's edition. Nice. Very nice. I always like the design on these boxes. Mm -hmm. You get what you pay for. The Ghost of Tsushima. Sliding it open. Ooh. Very nicely wrapped. <laughs> So while we're watching him, um, you know, since this was released, I've been seeing a lot of people uh, um, playing this or streaming this game. And when I was watching the gameplay, it looked very interesting. I mean, you know, you know me, I love the Japanese culture and like Japan just in general, and this really interested me. So. Yeah, and uh, we 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 were planning a trip again to go back to Japan one of these days. Yeah, but due to the corona, COVID-19 issue, we're stuck it's at off the cards, but hopefully Monday. Yeah. We'll make a plan. Of it. Main piece of the collection. Yeah, it looks like he's getting to the meat and potatoes. Now. The best part. It's another statue or something? It looks like it. You wrapped it tightly. That's good, so it doesn't move. I mean, if it's something breakable, of course we, we want that to be sec very secure. <laughs> Looks like a uh, scotch tape right to secure it properly. Okay, here he goes. He's opening it. Oh. Okay, I wonder what it is. I'm really, really... <sighs> is it what I think it is? Oh! An Oni mask. That looks cool. Oh my god, that is so awesome. It's made of nice material. Yeah, it's an Oni mask. Should put this on all <laughs> He's gonna keep it on all day. <laughs> so Henner, why do samurais wear these type of masks? Well, you know, they they call it the Oni mask, you know, like a demon. Oni means demon and I guess this is like they're just their battle mask when they're fighting either, you know, bad guys or demons, I guess, and that's my my definition. And I think it's also like sort of protects their face too, right, from the swords. Like it's um, another extension of their armor. In a way, yeah. And it's it more, I think, to scare the other enemy. Yeah. If you see that person running at you with that mask, 
I'm gonna run away. <laughs> <laughs> I would love to have that in my collection though. Okay. Buy the game just with a mask. You know, I've done that too. <laughs> <laughs> this is the art book. Looks nice. Art book. This looks good. That's good. That's hard to put a book. Hard cover too, very nice. This is the game in a steel case. Nice. Steel case, yes. Of course. Nicely designed inside as well. Yeah. In here. Lots of surprises inside, huh? That's about it. Okay. Yeah. It's, not, it's not as much as the one we saw last time. Okay. Okay. T-shirt? If there's if that's a bag, that's it. I'm buying this. <laughs> <laughs> Tablecloth. <laughs> What's that? Like a hanky, handkerchief? Ah, uh, it's probably something to do with like, the uniform. Nice. Okay. It's like a sash or something for samurai, I guess. Okay. So far. Interesting. Here. That's probably the. Um, the strings for the mask. Oh no, oh, it's just to uh, like a stand? display. Yeah. Sure. Uh, it's like a center. <laughs> <laughs> Score. Like a scroll, yeah. It's the map. I think that's the map of the game. Oh, it really? Looks like it. Instructions, manuals, how to set that up. Oh, okay, there we go. Instructions. <laughs> <laughs> Good guess for me, huh? <laughs> so this is just the, the base. Okay. Oh, the base. And I wish I had my display case. That's a nice display, though. Yeah, put it on your definitely. Uh, oni mask. Yep. Yeah, it seems like the yeah the oni mask is made of ceramic, which is good. So it's not gonna break easy. No, but if you drop it, it's gonna crack. Of it, course, it's ceramic, so yeah. It looks like it's a well-built quality. There we go. Cool. Uh, I would love to have that in my collection. Okay. That's awesome. And uh, one last thing here. It's probably the flag. Yep, it's their banner. Oh, good, good okay. guess, huh? So it's another scroll. Yeah, it's yeah. a Japanese banner. Don't they hang that on the back of their armor? Yeah, sometimes? they they have a uh, the one of those uh, infantrymen. They have mm. like a uh, you know the the the, um, the poles. And then the flag sticking up. The flag sticking up up top. It, it's you know, it uh, as their insignia. Mm. So that's pretty cool. For unboxing, if you enjoyed, uh, yeah, leave a like, subscribe, click the notification, all that stuff. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So what do you think, Hannah? Really like it. Um, first question, Vern. I mean, I'm not too familiar with it. How much is the uh, collection edition? Since you and mm. Yvonne is the one that the gamer guys. I the... didn't do my research on that. I would guess, hazard to guess, it's probably going to be around the range of 175, 200. Okay. Something like Last of Us yeah. 2. 
even though The Last of Us 2 had a lot more things inside, including the book bag and that statue, mm -hmm. this one actually had the, the mask, so that yeah, was pretty cool. Yeah, the mask. Yeah, I mean, if you're a real hardcore. Uh, hardcore collector, that mask would be a very, very nice uh, thing to add into your collection. It looks like it's a very high quality ceramic mask, the Oni mask. You know? I would love to have that and display it in my house. With it all day like eat <laughs> <laughs> no that one that you one, can't wear that <laughs> you can't wear that because they didn't put a string on they didn't include a string on that because you know usually you know it covers into your mask but doesn't look it's just mainly for display mm -hmm. but I, as friend he was you know mocking on it seems like a very high quality one and of course you know with the the japanese banner like you know the flag the flag and uh, i believe the sash is that gray one that he used as a tablecloth you know <laughs> and hard book cover with the art and of course the game itself um, as I mentioned earlier that I've seen gameplay of uh, streamers and, and other people that you know playing the game and it, re it really got my interest on it but I'm not sure if I'll be able to pick up the game unless I really want that Oni mask just the Oni mask <laughs> <laughs> but because you know why because I'm just too addicted to Call of Duty I don't know if I have you know yeah. play any other games but for what I, from what I did see from the games uh, gameplay of other streamers out there, it looked very good. It's like it's one of those uh, open world open world games. But you guys said that you know you could level up and stuff like that. But I heard this really good storyline to it. I haven't seen it. My brother's been playing it, so I haven't touched it yet. So um, did you get the collector's? No, but you didn't get. The no, I just got the regular edition. The regular edition. <laughs> but you know, Ivan. Is a, a big collector as well, as you can see. That's his second un, uh, unboxing unboxing for us. You know, thanks a big shout out to uh, Ivan on uh, Inc. Uh, seventy seven at Twitch TV. Um, but yeah, I mean, I really like the gameplay on that one. Whatever I seen, and the graphics was good. Yeah, the hell of graphics compared to the graphics back in our days when <laughs> we used to play. Now the graphics is just mm, so next deliciously level. the next level. CGs are very very crisp and very realistic these days and uh, I hope I mean you know I'm not sure if I'm gonna be able to play and give you a good review but you know I'll, I'll let you know once I start playing it mm -hmm. Last of Us 2 is pretty good so far I heard storyline was not that great but mm -hmm. I'm enjoying it so I'm assuming this is the last of us <laughs> <laughs> this is actually the last exclusive game for the PS4 uh -huh. so because you know, as you know, PS5 is coming out. Yeah, of course. Christmas time. So. Oh, this one is coming out. Yeah. Christmas time. So we're probably gonna be unboxing that when it comes out. So look forward to that. <laughs> yeah. So here's a trailer for Ghost of Tsushima. Hope you like it. You are a samurai, bound to uphold the code. Live, fight, and die with honor. If you stray from this path, what will you become? Anyway, Hunter, any, anything else you want to add? Um, no, I mean, I would really like to try to play that game. Or could I still buy that uh, limited edition? I think so. I'll look it up. Might be already hard to get. You know, scalpers are always picking these up and selling it for like yeah, I'm, I'm ridiculous a amounts of money. What? Money. I'm gonna ask Eve if uh, how much it is and if it's within my budget. I'm gonna go pick it up. I know he bought it from Best Buy. Yeah, pick up from Best Buy. So uh -huh. I'm gonna check out Best Buy and see how much it is. And if it's within my budget, I'll probably end up, you know, me. I'll probably just end up getting it for the mask. The mask. <laughs> I love, I'm a collector. Collector, yet not collecting at the same time. Yeah, I have some space issues in my place. That's why. But <laughs> I would love to display my uh, all my collections of uh, other figures here and there. But you know. yeah, space is always an issue, especially yeah. if you're a collector. So especially if you're just renting the place. You know, <laughs> You don't want to put too much stuff when you have to move, then you have to, you know, pick it up and go. Yeah. So, so Heather, last words. Please don't forget to comment, subscribe, and hit that bell button. Ding, ding, ding. See you guys. Bye.